Five years ago, I followed a whole food, gluten-free, and refined sugar-free way of eating. I always wanted to make it plant-based as well, but my family makes ultra-delicious meals that I thought I couldn't live without. I've also done regular detox, eliminating fish, meat, poultry, dairy, from my diet for 21 days for each detox program. But I would always go back to my favorites after each cleanse. This year, however, after watching Game Changers, I went plant-based overnight, but only aimed for a 40-day goal. Now, it's been 200 plus days, and I'm still on it, and I'm loving my choice of going plant-based, eating whole foods, and staying gluten-free and refined sugar-free. The first thing I did was to clean and organize our pantry removing pantry supplies that will not support my goal. The first thing I stocked up on are spices. They definitely helped me create culinary magic. These spices took my cooking through a taste of different cuisines. Mediterranean, Indian, Thai, Chinese, Japanese, Italian, Mexican. Yes, like a whole new world of flavors. I also got beans, nuts, and different types of gluten-free flours, as well as refined sugar-free sweeteners for making desserts. To make my transition to plant-based exciting and satisfying, I prepared our meals by having daily themes. Our first day was Japanese. Day two was Thai. Day three was Spanish. Day four was American. Day 5, Italian. Day 6, Mediterranean. Day 7, Filipino. We reached Day 40, and I never really ran out of varieties to prepare while learning so much modern and traditional ways of cooking. Since I'm also preparing food for my daughter, who agreed to go plant this with me, I got extra motivated to prepare good food. Her thumbs up! and 5-star ratings gave me inspiration and fulfillment. Even my whole family started eating our food too. By having a time-bound goal, a meal plan, and curiosity to create new dishes, we were able to go through our 40-day transition with a bliss. There were times when it was challenging like when we were eating out with friends or being pressed for time to cook food. The most challenging would be those times when we have those cravings for the texture of food that has been ingrained on our taste buds throughout our life. But by having a goal in mind, we were able to stick to our plan. I've benefited so much from this journey that I chose to stay on it. I feel lighter and stronger in my yoga practice and exercises. I felt calmer and more attuned with what I eat. I got more curious with how I can nourish my family well. I even got my vegan nutritionist diploma to make sure we are properly nourished. I got to express my love and creativity in another avenue which is food and meal preparations. I have an ever-growing curiosity to create easy to prepare, delectable, whole food, and plant-based meals. Pre-made healthy sauces that you can use for everyday quick cooking. Pre-mixed natural spices that you can use anytime you cook. Pantry staples like beans, nuts, noodles, flours, natural sweeteners. Fridge favorite like tofu, leafy greens, and other veggies. Meal planning by designing it yourself or referring to online weekly meal plans designed by vegan nutritionists and customizing it according to your needs. I hope that this will inspire you to start your plant-based journey or motivate you to stay on it. Be healthy, be well, stay nourished, and inspired.